Blake Axelson. I'm 17. I live in Aspen, Colorado. We're here this week riding my local resort with all the homies from Arbor. Got Scott Vine and Ian Sams up there and they shredded it, killing every feature that they hit. It was just so sick to see. Like, don't get to see that very much in our park, so it was awesome. So it's finally winter. We're in Aspen. It's crazy because the Tahoe's had no snow, literally bone dry on the day that we left to come out for X Games and some Arbor team shooting. We got snow in Tahoe, so I left that, but it's fishing here. And there's a spot that I've always wanted to hit. I saw it like a couple years ago. And Blake got the directions from a local homie. And yeah, we got the whole crew out here. Sun is shining, and we're gonna get after it, man. Get creative with this old decrepit building. There's a pool and the walls on fire I soak my head in the sink for a while Shows my neck and it makes me smile But my bones have to move and my skin's gotta breathe You pick up the phone and I'm so relieved uh, This year I think Nick's in the X Games because he's just super consistent and one of the best up and coming riders that are actually like turning super pro. I, I sincerely think that he's, he's a super nice guy, you know, he's extremely personable and his riding speaks for itself, I think. 
I was one of six invited riders to the Winter X Games 2012 Real Street, and that was that was a privilege. For me, uh, my focus and priority of my career has always been snowboarding in urban environments, and because the X Games event I was doing was going to be a recreation of an urban environment, uh, preparing for X Games uh, was was kind of simple. I just was going to go about my, my everyday business, do what I do, film snowboarding in, uh, in the streets. And so that's kind of just stuck to that in terms of training. And uh, so I got like a cab hardway 270, pretty sick onto like the gap out the down bar. And I got like a front sev on the uh, down C rail, got a couple other moves. But it still was like, I was on the verge of that, that second and third place and was the only top two that went to finals and Forrest Bailey um, was in number one. So I knew final drop in that I needed something. So it came down to, to the wire. I had like one more drop. Oh, that's so you know, everything took over, X Games took over and got Cab Hardway 360 onto the down bar. I'd never done that move before. And I landed and, and that's what got me into finals and I was so stoked. Yeah, I got a bronze medal in, in X.